Hey guys, it's Heather. So today we're just doing FabFitFun unboxing spring 2024 plus add-ons. How's that for a short intro? So I know you guys like some huge, right? Okay, so I remember to remember my FabFitFun t-shirt. Like I bought it like forever ago and I was like, I'm gonna wear my FabFitFun. I bought like a couple of different colors. I'm gonna wear it every time I do an unboxing cause it'll be fun. And like I've only remembered one other time. And I love that I have a, a subscriber out there that actually noticed too, so thanks. Appreciate it. Anyway, um, so yeah, what we got here is we got spring 2024. It's coming guys, just hang on, it's coming. Normally it's like, once we get to this time of the year, we're like, <sighs> Like, get me out of this winter. I don't know about you guys, but it's been like a super mild winter. I'm, I'm almost kind of afraid because I know March can get super snowy, but we really haven't had much snow. I think total throughout the whole year of where we're at in Minnesota, we've only had like maybe four inches. Like normally we've got big drifts out there. My dog's playing King of the Mountain. Do you guys remember playing King of the Mountain when you're, anyway, sorry, I'm sidetracking. Anyway, okay guys, so let's get into this, right? Like, I didn't do any um, edit sales or flash sales or whatever the heck they do over there. Um, I just did the spring box with a few add-ons and I got some good add-ons. Okay, so we got, some, we got some stuff in here. So some of this is add-ons. How do I know what's add-on? Because I can't remember. You guys know me, I can't remember anything. Okay, so I know these are add-ons. Those that have been here and watched my stuff, you guys know what the deal is with this. You know I friggin' love these. However, original price, I believe for this size, the 5.1 ounce at like Ulta is $37. Oh, they don't have it anymore. Ah, they just recently took it off. It's not in here anymore. Oh no. So maybe they're getting rid of this. You guys don't panic yet. Okay, just calm. Don't pa don't panic. Oh my goodness, you guys, what am I gonna do? Nobody panic. Nobody panic. But I don't even see these at Ulta anymore. You guys, if they get rid of my favorite lotion. I have tons of other lotions. Like I love my hand lotions. I love all kinds of different lotions and scents and things like that. But this has got a pretty good grip on me. So 14 is kind of like my max that I don't want to pay more for this, even though yes, I love it. I'm kind of like maxed out like $14. Like I don't want to pay any more than that per, per bottle. So here's what it is. Um, just to remind you guys, for those that are new, Dead Sea Water Mineral Hand Cream in the Scent of Sea Kissed. So it's this blue bottle. They have purple, there's um, there's like a fuchsia color, like a hot pink, and there's some other ones too. But I don't know, maybe they're getting rid of this line, but um, I really do enjoy it. And one of, my, uh, one of you guys out there even sent me a bottle. Like how freaking sweet is that? So what else do we have in here? I believe this is an add-on. Um, I love this shampoo. I use it like at least once a week. It's my purple shampoo I use because th these highlights, I pay for these, right? I pay for these. So at least once a week, I use the Olaplex, the Olaplex number 4P. Um, it's a blonde enhancer toning shampoo. This, and this is another one. I will pay full price for this. I think full price is like $30, but they had it at FabFitFun for $14, so um, I, I snatched another one of those up. Ay, 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 ay. Um, nice, new, and perfectly you. What is this? Scratch to reveal if you've won. Scratch and reveal what? What do I scratch? But what do you... Is it the bag? What do you what do you scratch? Scratch to reveal if you want, but I don't understand what you scratch. I don't see. Is it the bag? Am I supposed to scratch this bag because it doesn't feel any different? All right, I'll scratch the bag. Oh, you do scratch the bag. It didn't feel like it. It felt this. It felt like the same. I'm sorry. I guess it's one of those scannable code things. 
Why can't you just tell me if I won on the card? Sorry, not a winner. But now they have my address and my email. So basically, I think it's just their way of collecting your info and your email. So now I'm going to have to unsubscribe from all of the um, emails that I'm going to be flooded with, with all the junk emails. So. Okay, so yeah. Looking at my order, the oh, this was an add-on. These lotions were an add-on. And this was like a free item. Like they only had like so many of them. When you buy so many, I don't know. I don't, I just saw that the, there was no price. There was no cost to this. It was free. You had to select like what hair color you had and then you grab one of these for free. So I grabbed the Blonde Perfection. It's a root concealer for blondes. Like what? what is that? I don't even know. So this temporarily a touch up spray that lightens up and brightens to blend dark roots. Here's what the bottle looks like. We spray it on a tissue. I want to see what it looks like. So it's like spray paint. And I don't know if that would that would look quite right. Like like it's wash hair day. It might be fun to try it because then if it looks terrible, I'm just getting in the shower anyway. You know what I mean? Okay. So those are the only add-ons that I had. Everything else was part of the box. And then I only have like one other thing in here that is, um, it's an additional choice item. Um, so I made my choices and then this is an additional choice item that I chose to purchase. And it was $13. It's the Pat McGrath Perma Precision Liquid Eyeliner. So I grabbed this mainly because it's um, Pat McGrath. I use liquid eyeliners when I wear lashes. Um, I don't always use a liquid liner when I wear a lash, but just depends on how it looks on my eye. If I'm wearing like a half lash, to take it to where the half lash ends, and then I just kind of bring a little line to the, you know, the inner corner of my eye, just so it doesn't, you don't see where that lash ends just to kind of like blend it in, I guess. So that's why I love these. And then I figure if it, um, if I end up not liking it, which I don't, can't imagine I wouldn't because I, I've got tons of these, I can give it to my oldest daughter who loves um, liquid liners. Looks good. Oh, heart. Do you guys ever get a song stuck in your head? So I said that to my husband the other day. I was like, oh, like, oh, I got the song stuck in my head. And then I'd sing like part of it. And then he's like, did you know that um, people that get songs stuck in their head have low IQs? I was like, oh, that's a, that's a fun fact. I didn't know that. And I was like, hey. I was like, what are you calling me? And then he was laughing. I still don't know if that's true or not. We've been together a long time, so. I know, like, he's just, he's being silly. So it looks like we have six things that I selected for, like, customizing my box. So one of the things that I selected is it there, this is um, Short Stories Large Basket. There's so many different things you could use this for. Put it in your guest room whatever like there there's endless possibilities with this like who doesn't want like a nice little basket and I love how they have the handles you know it's part of the basket the handles it just the rope that wraps around and then they just kind of bring it up and those are your handles it's very cute it feels really nice quality I like this I'd love to hear your ideas on what to use this for so many things you could like roll up washcloths and put them in here cat toys like I'd love to hear it like please tell me give me some ideas on what to use this basket for the living proof perfect hair day dry shampoo you guys know this is like my dry shampoo that I use I've tried many 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 dry shampoos I keep going back to this one I think I'm done trying dry shampoos unless the company wants to send me some dry shampoo I'm willing to like try it out review it but for the most part buying a new dry shampoo I don't know this just 
If it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? Like this stuff does it. It works great. It's not too perfumey. It doesn't irritate my skin. This stuff's great. I love this. So when I have an opportunity to pick it up at a discount, guess what I do? <laughs> You'll never guess. I buy it. I, I get it. I pick it up. I, I grab it. Bring it home with me. Is that right? I thought I would try grabbing things that are not like beauty items. Like I want more like houseware things, like this basket, like glasses, things like that. Like give me things that aren't gonna expire basically, right? <laughs> I want things that don't expire. So here, this is a Millennium Collection glassware. And even if I end up not using this, like, it might be a, like a like a fun gift, like, especially if you're gonna like put together a gift basket, housewarming gift, whatever, like you have this basket and then these glasses and then like whatever else, like it, it's just, they're, they're cute, they're unique. They are glass. Four different colors. Try not to drop them, don't drop them. Pretty like amber color, light pink, like a sage green, and then this really pretty purple. Very summery, spring fun. This holds 10 ounces. That's really? Seems like the math ain't mathing on that one. Plus this down here is like so small. But the brand is called Yield. If I ever see these again, I think I might grab one more box because personally I don't think I like to have like more of a set, but in my little brain, I need to have like a, a set of eight or a set of 12. <laughs> but anyway, so the other thing that we have in here, which I think we should get this out and try it. The brand is AG Care, Air Light Volumizing Mousse, Sugar King e Extract for Natural Volume, Texture and Shine. Vegan and cruelty free. Kind of looks like a like a mousse, but um, not like a super like. It's more of like a watery mousse. But this feels very light and airy. You know, kind of like whipped egg whites, like super light and airy. And I have it everywhere. Barely has a scent, but it has something. What is that? Fused with natural cornstarch and sugar cane extract. Cornstarch in a hair mousse. Is that normal? Is that a thing? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try that. I just like how the scent is just basically almost non-existent, um, but there is something there, but it's super, super light. It's not gonna weight you down. It's super light and airy. Let's see, Malin and goats, strawberry, Apothecary. Oh, is this that strawberry perfume? I yeah, 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 yeah. I remember seeing this and you could pick whatever scent you wanted and strawberry, you know, it's like strawberry perfume. I think I might like that. Well, I'm not getting strawberry from that. How do you get strawberry from that? We're gonna let that sit a little bit. Um, Maybe it just needs to like kind of air out a little and, but right now um, it just smells just kind of heavy, which I wouldn't think with strawberry perfume, but we're gonna let that sit on the back of a hand a little bit and we're gonna go over like this other item in here and then um, we'll circle back. Okay, so the last thing in here and then we'll, we'll go back to this um, is a fun bag. Now I want to see, what do they call it? Like a workout bag maybe? It's a Beyond Yoga convertible gym bag in the color Birch. Cause I think they had like other colors you could pick. Um, does Heather do yoga? Mm -mm. No ma'am, Heather does not do yoga. But I didn't get this with the intent of using it for yoga or even like going to the gym because I don't go to the gym. I don't think I ever would. 
Um, I think I, I'm more of a um, just buy some pieces of equipment and yoga mats and things and like I'd rather do it in my own home. Oh, that's actually very cool. That is very cool. Okay, you guys, look at this. I didn't even know that. So you can wear it like a backpack. Is that ever cute? It has the adjustable straps to make it, you know, fit however you'd like. And then if you don't want to wear it like a backpack, look at this over here. You just pull that, these straps go in and up against the bag. And then it's a shoulder bag. This feels really, really nice. So that would be the only thing then when you go to inside of it, those straps kind of go across, but they're off to the side. So I don't think that's a big deal. I mean, you know, you're good. It has the compartment on the bottom, I suppose, for like your shoes. Isn't that what that's used for? Or for your dirty gym clothes or your dirty towel or... So this would be good just for even just traveling. It seems like it's like a wipeable material. The outside is, it feels like it's a wipeable material, but the inside also feels like it's like a, like just slightly different where you could like wipe it with like a disinfecting wipe. It's got the little pockets on the side for your, you know, your water bottles. And then inside, you know, one small little zipped pouch. So either you can just snap it. There's like one little snap. It's not a magnet, it's an actual snap. Or you can pull it, pull the strings and then do that, do one of those things. Let's circle back and look at the perfume here. So now that the perfume, so this is an oil, like it's left the back of my hand kind of oily. But now that it had a chance to kind of um, aerate and kind of air out a little bit, the it's kind of calmed down quite a bit, so um, not so intense. But I still don't smell a strawberry in there. I don't see where where the strawberries coming from. <laughs> I, don't, I don't. I don't. I'm not getting that. When I saw the strawberry, I kind of thought, well, like light and fresh, maybe a little sweet. But this, I don't get that at all with this. So I'm kind of confused by this, and it's not really my scent. So I'll see if my girls want it, but um, this, this one's not for me at all. I don't care for that at all. I don't know, did you guys see these at FabFitFun? Did you grab a scent? Like, what? which one did you grab? I'm kind of confused by that. Anyway, that's it, guys. It was just a short little video today. I gotta go make some snacks for the game. Because um, I love watching the commercials <laughs> and eating food. It's, I'm here for it. Alright guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!